Nigeria Premier Football League has signed a five-year deal with Star Times to broadcast the league on television. This was disclosed during a deal signing ceremony in Abuja. Trust TV's Adeni Ajishafe tells us more. Nigerians calling for the projection of MPFL will heave a sigh of relief as MPFL and Star Times have signed a partnership to show the top flight league on television. The broadcast deal signed in Abuja will allow soccer loving Nigerians to have access to some matches on TV. Chairman MPFL Benga Legbeleye calls for more partnership in promoting Nigerian Premier Football League as we enhance the league development, setting that visibility is needed to boost the image of MPFL. While delivering keynote address, Chief Executive Officer Star Times Joshua Wang expressed joy in the partnership. Wang said the commitment to over 45 million viewers in 35 countries across Africa, showing off Rwanda, Ghana, and Tanzania leagues, among others, spurred them into partnership with MPFL. With the love of football in Nigeria, the commitment has made Star Times engage the MPFL and hope to add more to the development of Nigerian league by bringing to people the visibility of the league on television, which will go a long way in making people fall in love with the league. We are committed to growing the sports industry in Nigeria by collaborating with our local partner and sharing positive Nigerian stories. Representative of Director General Nigerian Television Authority, Betty Ihiabriki, calls on Nigeria to support MPFL just the way they watch the foreign leagues. We therefore call on all well-meaning Nigerians, sponsors, and captains of industries to invest in these valuable projects. NFL President Ibrahim Gusso believes the projection of MPFL will boost the league and hopefully makes it one of the top five leagues in Africa. There's going to be a dedicated channel on Star Time. It's not going to be on any channel, but it's going to be a dedicated channel, which is going to be addressed as MPFL channel. So you just need to go to a paper channel on Star Time and you watch the Nigerian player on board. The broadcast deal signed in Abuja will have two MPFL matches shown on March days from November 18 to February 18, while from February onward it will have four matches per match day in the first two seasons. The remaining three years that completes the five-year deal, we have eight matches to project. That's Sport News. I'm Adeni Aji Shafe. All right, Adeni Aji Shafe, our sports correspondent, still have some more updates. Football enthusiasts around the continent of Africa eagerly await the winner of 2023 Africa's top footballers to celebrate talent and dedication to the game of football. Nigerian football star Victor Osime has been nominated for the 2023 CAF Men's Player of the Year. Osime shortlisted for the award alongside Sadio Mane, Mohamed Salah, Riyad Mahrez and 26 other nominees for the prestigious African Footballer of the Year Award. Confederation of African Football set the stage for a fierce competition among some of the continent's most outstanding footballers. A panel of CAF technical experts, African football legends and selected media representatives from a number of countries put together the preliminary list for the various categories with the performance of the nominees between November 2022 and September 2023, serving as the period under consideration. Osime is favorized to win the award following his impressive display for Serie A club Napoli last season. The Nigeria International scored 26 goals in title appearances to help the Patanope win their first Kudeto in 33 years in 2022-2023 campaign. Osime finished in 8th position in 2023 Ballon d'Or Award as the first Nigerian to make top 10. Meanwhile, Nigerian young forward Gift Urban is in the running for Calf Young Player of the Year. Urban has scored 27 goals in all competitions for Belgian Pro League club KAA Ghent since he arrived from Norwegian outfit Stabek in January. Winner of African Footballer of the Year World will be crowned on 11 December in Marrakesh, Morocco. That's Sport News. I'm Adeni Ajishafe.